Okay, so I'm going to show you the process to create uh, this sound. Let's uh, listen to it now. Okay, it's kind of peaceful, uh, calm atmosphere. And um, it was based on a singing ball, like it's uh, described in the name. Uh, exactly that one. Here. It's a sound uh, Stefan recorded uh, in Romania, I think, and it's a good uh, base uh, source because there are, there are a lot of harmonics, there are a movement oscillation in the uh, in the sound and a good, pretty good transient attack. So in Reaper, um, I use the mangle to to transform this, the initial sound. And uh, everything is done in in a bidule here. It is, is not very sexy, but it's very powerful. So mangle is here, and here uh, is the FX chain after that. So let's hear the the result to begin. By the way. Because uh, there are a lot of random modulation in the patch, each time I press play, a new version of the sound is created. So, basically, it's two layers. We have a low layer here and a high layer. The source sound is the same, but the settings are different, especially the filters. We can uh, listen in solo and we're gonna I'm gonna uh, bypass the effect chain for you to hear only the granular process so low in solo without any effects Okay, let's uh, hear the high layer this time. So it's a little bit dry right now. The cool thing is this pitch quantize option. So every pitch modulation is quantized in a minor scale. Sounds a little bit detuned because of the harmonics. Uh, and now with the FX chain after that, um, composed of modal, a kind of very cool um, resonator, uh, an EQ who is modulated in real time by Vidul. So I'm gonna let it here for you to, to see the modulation. Uh, and my favorite uh, reverb, um, turbo reverb from Melda Production. So here we go, both layers with effect chain. Oops. And that's it.